Okay, <clears throat> what we're going to do is show our compliance with the second technical deliverables with our thermal management system, how our battery management system can turn on cooling fans. Um, this is a mock-up right now. We had to remove the uh, drive system from the vehicle to finish our body work. And if you'll take a look here, I'll show you. We have indicators. This LED next to the fan is going to come on. when the fan is supposed to come on and the fan is connected to our battery management system and it'll start running. Okay, what I'm going to do now is change the temperature which the fan turns itself or the battery management system turns the fan on. This is to simulate the uh, the fan needing to come on because the temperature is rising. We're just doing it by lowering the temperature which it's supposed to come on. Sorry, so. I'm connected to our battery management system. The on temperature right now is set at 20 degrees Celsius. The ambient temperature is roughly 14 degrees Celsius. So I'm going to change it to 13 degrees Celsius and see if that's cold enough to turn the fan on. And if you'll notice, the fan has started running. Okay, I'm going to cycle through this again so that you'll see that we are not touching it other than changing this parameter, 20 degrees Celsius, and the fan comes to a stop. And I'm going to change it back to 13 degrees Celsius, which is one degree cooler than the ambient temperature, and the LED has illuminated, saying that the fan is turned on, and our fan is running. And now I'm going to simulate a fault condition. Our fan has tried to cool off. Our fault is under our fault parameter. Our over temperature fault is what I'm going to adjust. I'm going to adjust that to 13 degrees Celsius. This takes a second and then it will fault. and now it has faulted. This fault will cause our drive system to be de-energized, our contactors to open, and will have to be reset by hooking a laptop up to reset it. This um, is the over temperature fault is what I changed to cause it to fault. I think so the over temperature fault locks out the drive system system and battery system through the battery management system? Is that what you're the saying? The way I have it designed, the contactors will open when there is a battery management system fault. Excellent. Can we also see this, instead of just by changing the parameters on the computer, can we heat up one of the boards a little bit and simulate the temperature what rise? What we're going to do now is to actually raise the temperature of the cell boards to simulate the battery management system having to turn on the fans. We're doing this by using a heat gun. First, the fan is going to come on. Then after the fan comes on, if we, I have set it up so that as the heat, as the temperature increases, it will fault. Are we ready to go? What happens at fault? Uh, at fault, um, it indicates a fault, and the contactors would open. Uh, the vehicle would lose the ability to cause propulsion. It would, it would stop running. All right, let's see it. Keep your eye on the fan. Oh. This may take a little bit. See the fan's on now? Fan started. Okay, and we're, we're going to probably be faulting here in a little bit. It's a little bit hotter to cause a fault. There's the fault. If I cool them off, the fan should have the fan should go off. So in fault mode, it locks out the system, but the fans remain on to cool the batteries. Yeah. Nice.
Because they're, they're not powered by the same. Now, is there more than one fan? This one says it's 19 CFM on the side. There's more than one fan. This this is to simulate what it would be. It would be controlling a relay that drives the larger fans. Now, will this cool it enough that it shuts off the fault, or do we have to go into the computer we and have, shut it we off? We have to manually uh, release the fault. Okay. And there it shuts off. And there it shuts off. Excellent. Fan goes off. The indicator light on the BMS shuts off. About five and a half minutes time to cool the batteries from that temperature which the system was locked out.